at 5 o'clock, multiple great white sharks spotted off the coast of the Cape today. WBZ's Bill Shields is live for us in Chatham tonight, where Bill swimmers need to be on alert. They do, David. And, you know, to me, it's kind of like death and taxes. You know at some point it's coming. Well, summer is coming. It's here. So are the great whites. Summer has finally arrived, and with it, the crowds in Chatham, and of course, the great white sharks. A fisherman spotted a 13-footer off of Monomoy just this morning. It's that time of year. We're, we're bound to get um, reports of uh, white sharks when we have calm days and the sun is high in the sky. Over the past several summers, the state's marine biologist, Greg Scomel, has tagged 150 great whites, in part to monitor their return. And tourists now often come to see the elusive predators, which keep some people out of the water. No, it doesn't surprise me. They're out there, and that's their habitat. I don't think they want us, but... They make mistakes. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> and I don't want to be the person that gets them the mistake made on. But others say swimming in the ocean has to be done, but with limits. The water's warm enough. <laughs> Don't swim too far. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. They make me a little nervous, but I just will swim cautiously. The sharks are back. What else is new? It's the summer, isn't it? For the past few summers, Dr. Greg Scomel has been working the outer cape, the ocean side cape water, tagging sharks. Today, he was over on the bay side, and we talked just moments ago. They spotted, they did not tag, but they spotted seven great whites on the bay side. Reporting live from Chatham, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Mm -hmm.